Hello, my name's Tony and welcome back to Predicted and this is Two Minute Tuesday. In today's episode, I'm going to be reviewing and Brookside by Zara. Stay tuned. So this is the presentation. Let me run through some of the notes in it for you. In the top we have violet, in the mid we have cardamom, and in the base we have sandalwood and ambroxine. So that didn't take long. So you've seen what the bottle looks like. This is the atomizer. Very good wide spray on it. So this is based around the note of ambroxine. It's quite synthetic as you can imagine. But this is a clone of this. So eccentric 02 by eccentric molecules. It is pretty much exactly the same. The notes differ slightly. I'll tell you that performance on this is better. So you pay a lot more for this and it projects and performs better. However, you get the same scent profile with this. It doesn't smell anything like Sauvage to me. It doesn't smell anything like some of the heavy Ambroxin fragrances. It just smells quite faint and quite soft. It's got a slight ambery, woody note to it. The It disappears quite quickly. I got three to four hours where it turned into then a very close skin scent. Now I have heard other people mention, especially with the original, that although you can't pick up on it, you might go a bit nose blind to it, other people can still enjoy it around you. And I was hoping this would do that. I might be wrong so far, but performance is lacking, unfortunately. But it was just 12 99 for this 80 ml bottle. I think the presentation's fantastic. It is a nice welcome addition to my collection because I haven't got anything like it apart from this small sample. And I think it's a bit of a dumb reach, something that you could spray if you don't want to offend anybody. For example, if you wore it in a school, if you were a teacher or you wore it in a hospital, again, I don't think this would ever harm anybody or get in the way of your working day. Just be warned though, you probably will need to take it with you to reapply later in the day. So it hasn't blown me away, but in my eyes worth picking up for $12.99. I didn't pick up an awful lot. It's just a very faint, pleasant smell. Doesn't knock my socks off, certainly. So I hope you've enjoyed the review. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to like the video. I'll see you again next week in Two Minute Tuesday. And don't forget to keep smelling wonderful.